Hey, what's up, everyone? It's your friend 23 here, and welcome back to a new episode of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. <clears throat> In the last episode, we started our journey towards um, the town. Is it called Gerudo Town? <laughs> and I was thinking today, let's finish that journey and get to to the last regional phenomena. We might not have time to do it today, but we should at least reach it. What is this? This is a store. I can buy your arrows, please. A lot rather to buy them from you than the dude outside here. Maybe he's not here anymore. He was a wandering traveler there with overpriced arrows. <laughs> Do you have anything special to say also? Journeying through the desert is rough. If you don't prepare right, you could try a hundred times and never make it through. The counter in the back is the front desk for the inn, so you can rest up before you travel if you like. Okay, so it's an inn here. Don't really need to rest. And don't really need to sell, but I need to buy some both, uh, both some food for heat resistance and... Uh, or uh, cold resistant. The cold resistant we don't need. We have the clothes for that. But these are not for making food. And I also forgot make forgot to make food between episodes here, <laughs> which I said I would do. But I'm I'm just gonna kick craft some quick food here. See you in a bit. So and we're back. I made. Let's uh, sort it here. I made. Now I have a lot of heat resistant food. And I also crafted some uh, simmered fruit here for some, some health also, which it can be good. Because knowing me, I usually take some damage during an episode. Okay, so we need to. I guess we need to go continue on the road here. But here it's some type of storm. So I'm not sure if I'm like gonna get sucked up by this. Okay, I managed, but I wonder if you're gonna follow this to get to the town. And also, can you use this to get some height? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, and you can get above the storm. Or it's pockets like this. Okay, you get above the storm. Was it an enemy here? It was. We have a camp. What are these monsters? Give those. Those I have never seen. I wonder how difficult they will be. That one is fine. Also wanna change weapon. Let's do this one handed. One, some extra damage. Okay, they seem really slow. Oh. Okay, so no damage with that type of weapon now. Maybe this? Why doesn't they take damage? <laughs> That's weird. It's the thing that you can only snipe them with an arrow. And we need a lot of damage. Soon the bow will break here. Are they like weak to fire or something? We should try that. Yeah, they were weak to fire.
Yeah, they one shot on fire. That's good to know. Ooh, Guido Bone. That's some high attack power. And these are also like weirding me out. Do they do they have a purpose? Let's gain some height. Because I I don't know where I'm going. There we have enemies. Let's go for that. See if they notice me. Oh. And I fail to land on the stairwell. Mm -mm -mm. Maybe should sneak also. And what type of clothes am I wearing? That one we really don't need. Cross legs can be good. Not right now, but when evening is coming. Did the other hear me? I don't think so. I think the sandstorm is making it easier to sneak also. We have one enemy there. Then we should maybe be able to ascend behind him. And then sneak strike. Ah, not quite. But that's okay. And who are you? Ow. Would have been easier just to do a double hit in the beginning and in the... Nice. A lot of palm fruits. Okay, so we're going that way. Where the shrine is. But I, if I remember correctly, there were a shrine over here as well. And is that the same type of... Enemies, yeah. Where did this go? Oh, now we need to change gear. Because even though I made some hot resistant food, I remembered I also bought this last episode. But it's not enough, huh? It's good we made some heat resistance as well then. This we need to photograph also. I hear the enemy also. Oh my god. That's not kind. Hold on. Rocky boomerang. A giant boomerang. I will drop the spear for that. I hear some more enemies. Put it up on here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god. That's a fail. He has a nice sword in his hand also. I think I want it. Is it an enemy arrow or is it your arrows? Gerudo Claymore. But it's two handed, he ha held it in one hand. Oh, it's an enemy that shoots arrows. Must be, yeah, yeah. How could I miss you? And here is an Electro Dude. Best fight. Huh. 
Got some arrows out of it though. I have no clue where we're going. I think this is the right way. Over there is some... Is it a dragon? Looks like some type of dragon flying in the distance. It would be fun to see the, the sign building guy here. Like next to this. Oh my god, good aim. Aimbot. <laughs> Desert Rift, huh? I feel that you really need to clear the original phenomena before <laughs> exploring this part of the of the game. It's way too much um, sand in the way here. Okay. So they're not one shot if you're not headshotting them with the fire. That's this easy to kill and drop that good of fusing um, fusing material. It's crazy. Melons. Gladly snap a pick on you guys. Oh my god, good, good picture. Oh, wood. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. There we have a sand thing to ascend on. Or not ascend, but... <laughs> you know what I mean, use the... Oh my god, what is that? Use the... The glider. Are these also weak against uh, fire? Hopefully. I oh, should have snapped a pick on that dude. Give the wings. A wing that catches the light. Arrows and thrown weapons play farther with this item. It's attached. Okay. Guess let's go to the shrine here. So even the shrine thing doesn't work. I know Garuda... Oh, it looks really... Dead. It's here where the... Um, Mattison has traveled, huh? I don't really think... She arrived here. Nearly above. Yep. Sounds about right. So the shrine is where we're going, actually. Okay, can we find a spot here to ascend? Yeah. Oh my god. Is it centimeter perfect precision needed? Yeah. Nice, nice, nice. Buried light. Oh, I mean, that just dropped the Kuroko sword. I, no, I didn't drop it. I didn't drop it. I was thinking about dropping it. Can we get both here? Yeah, nice. Little key. I guess we need the fan. Ah, oh, maybe, maybe the plan was using the fan to take away those. Now that I think about it. So then let's do that. 
That I have never seen. This is oh. That's where we're going, huh? But what is this thing? Should it attach here? Cannot be, huh? No. I will leave it there for now. Until we know what to do with it. I didn't even need to crouch here. Enemies. Or one enemy, rather. Not the clearest idea. Ah, here is a uh, ascend place. Ah, it gives us access to this side. Nice. Then it makes a bit more sense. Hopefully. There isn't one more of those. some type of light okay okay so I guess these are mirrors and you're gonna guide the light hmm. never done a shrine with these mechanics I'm guessing Something like that, maybe? No? <laughs> so are you always falling forward? No? Okay. I guess something like that. The light is on the on the wrong in the wrong um, room, so I have to angle the light a bit more. But I want it angled over there, huh? Something like that, I guess. Does the light need to stay sh shined on? No. Nice. So we've done the shrine now, but I want to see what this place is. It's been weird to have an other section like here, like this here. Uh, see if we manage to do our scuffed flying machine. Jump on. Ah. Almost. Maybe let's just jump on it bef in beforehand. Then we really need to center us. Oh my god, it's... <laughs> Always so difficult jumping on these places. These things. Nice. 
Oh my god. So close. There we go. And centered, centered. It's pretty centered, I guess. Nope. That's not. Now we need to add, turn it off. Don't need to throw that. Ah. It's easier to get it to go straight up if you jump up after the fact that it started. But it's really hard to do that. Let's do one more try. Maybe with a one-handed instead of a two-handed. Oh my god, I... It was better, but I jumped on a bit to the left there. This is good, this is good. Not good enough. I just need to go straight up. And I can glide. This is the last try. Then we're gonna... Skip it if it doesn't work. So close, so close, so close, and I fall down because I'm the worst. I was so close here. Yeah. Why not maybe do it against the wall? Yes, that's why. This is not the best. Maybe we stand against the wall and have like a slow backwards tra travel on it. No. Okay. I will not manage. <laughs> I don't even care that much. I tell myself at least. Now we have four of those. Oh, do I really need to do that part of the shrine? Or is that marking underneath me, maybe? That's really... Almost pretty straight on the shrine, but I guess it's in here we should go. Here are those uh, uh, plushes. This is Regius' diary. First page. I received an unsettling report from Bularia today. A strange haze, some have called it gloom, is emanating... I cannot say that word. Emanating from beneath Hyrule Castle. Those who touch it will fall ill. But my friends Link and Zelda are in Hyrule. I'm sure that those two can get to the bottom of the problem. Next page. A new, much more worrying report has arrived. Both Link and Zelda has gone missing while exploring below Hyrule Castle. Shortly after they were lost, the castle lifted off into the sky, where it was joined by countless small floating islands. So much happened that all at once. What is going on in the world? And are those two safe? Next page. Things grow more and more dire across Hyrule, and now the danger has come here as well. A sand shroud, the worst sandstorm in recent memory, has covered the area. People are taking shelter on the ground. We traveled out to see if we could dis discern the cause of it, 
but we were ambushed by a new monster called Gibitos. To make matter worse, I wasn't able to accurately hit them with the lightning I can call out. Uh, we're in we're inundated with the, those seeking safety from the sand shroud or the Gibdos, and we still don't know what has caused this. As the chief of Gerudo Town, I am to I am to blame for these failures. Next page. Uh, the fortification protecting the shelter are strong. There's no way the monsters will be able to break through. We're also lucky to have a good source of water in the shelter. But we must watch uh, for in invaders trying to use that waterways. Next page. Sitting here feeling sorry for myself won't solve anything. I'm going to leave Bularia in charge of the shelter and go train. The ruins to the north here aren't the uh, the ruins to the north aren't too far. They should be a perfect place for me to practice with my lightning. Despite my worries for my people and for the world, I must do what I can. I know that I know that's what Zelda would advise me to do. Oh Lady Urbosa, if only you were here to with us, watching watch over us all in these dark times and keep Zelda ending safe. Okay, so they say the tem temple was north of the north of the this uh, town. Should I photo this? Or what's the meaning here? Probably not. <laughs> okay, so this town is dead. Maybe it's here I'm gonna check. Guess not. So north from from the town. So I guess this might be the temple, or not? I don't know. like a classroom. That's weird. Oh. Was it an opening here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe it's down here we should go. Is that Ploka? Oh. Nothing to report, hmm? A vow. Did you come here to escape the Shanshaw? Well, you reached the entrance to the Gerardo shelter. But I cannot allow any vow to pass through this door. Oh. Oh, oh you never heard the word vow? Vow means man in Gerudo. There is a custom really more of a law that we Gerudo follows. Uh, young Gerudo are generally not allowed to interact with vow. Mm -hmm. I see people in there. Through the hole. And what's wrong? What's going on? Oh. A vow wandered in here. Ooh. What? Did you say vow? Ah. There's nothing to worry about. The vow is very short and can't even reach the peepholes in the door. He's out of sight and even on his tippy toes, he won't be able to see. Damn. Ah. That's some... That's a this. Uh, normally vow aren't allowed to even set foot within the walls of Gerudo Town. But this is a unique situation. Oh. So as long as you keep out of the shelter, I'll overlook I'll overlook your presence in town. If you're looking for some place to get out of the sand shroud, you can rest in one of the houses on the surface. Okay. Guess we need more gear to pass as a girl then. If we want to get in there. I feel like this cannot have to do with the shrine. And she told me that a thing was to the north in her di uh, in her diary. Let's go and read the diary just one more time here.
here I think. Uh, waterways. I'm going to leave Bellaria in charge of the shelter to go train. These ruins, the ruins to the north aren't too far. They should be in perfect place. The ruins to the north, I guess, we're going. Ruins to the north. Here we have enemies. I don't have a lot of fire fruits. That's no good. Uh, statue over here. I guess follow the statue now. But I, I have full... Full... Inventory of weapons already. I will let that sword be. Like that, you can see Zelda, uh, the Link's um, shadow. A funny little. Bit. Oh, maybe I should also collect these. They are nice. Okay, so that girl points this way. And I think north is this way still. I will just go for this. And north is here. And we have a big dude. A lot of enemies. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's just the Gibidos. Is there also weak for electricity? Which is good to know. Keep the guts, nice, nice, nice. And let's go up the wind here. Oh no. Boss fight, huh? That I didn't sign up for today. Maybe I don't have any choice, huh? Where is it go coming from? Show yourself then, Mulduga. Now it comes. There it comes. <laughs> So I need to chill until I feel a rumble in my controllers. There it is. Oh my god. So quick while it starts going. Can I snipe it now? Somehow? Uh... Yay, my bow is bro breaking. And now I should... Oh my god. Broke my bow. I can't see shit. <laughs> Where is the head? There is the head. Give me your eyes. I will use the headshot. The aimbot here. Ok. 
Okay, doesn't work, doesn't work, no good. Wow. He got me there, huh? And he got me again. His damage is crazy. I should have healed also, <laughs> of course. Like, can I bomb your eyes, maybe? This almost is worth taking this bow for, for this fight. something with a lot of damage why not one of these oh, there is your headshot spot huh now you work oh let me bring out some heavy artillery Should have snapped a picture on him before he died. <laughs> but I just wanted the fight to be over with. No. Stop <laughs> going upwards. A lot of nice material here. Yep. That's a nice sword as well. <sighs> I guess we drop. This one for it. Can I get my loot, please? That wasn't... Oh my god, I fail everything. Is it any more loot that is flying? Nope. That we don't need. This one we... Yes, we take. Go to that shrine over there. This looks like um, some sand that you will sink in if you go to, the, to into it. So I will try not to do that. Nice that you can see some things again here. So before they aggro all of them aggro me, let's try to take at least two of them out. Oh my, nice miss. There we go. Oh, they should die from the sand, also. Nice. Let's just open this sh shrine out. But, unfortunately, I have run out of time of re for recording today. Um, so, we have to do the shrine on in the next episode. So, a bit of a shorter episode today. I hope it's okay. If you have enjoyed this episode please as always consider liking the episode and also subscribe so you don't miss some future videos this has been 23 i will see you in the next video bye bye